and welcome to Vlogmas Day 11. So I'm wearing um, a me made Christmas jumper today. Um, this is the Grain Line Studio Linden sweatshirt and this is one that I made a few weeks ago. Um, it's got like Christmas trees and like, lots of different patterns and things on and uh, yeah because I thought I'm seeing my friends um, today for lunch so I thought it'd be nice to wear something a little bit Christmassy. So um, if you can hear any purring, I have Bentley in his little um, radiator bed. Um, they quite often argue over which one goes in what radiator bed because we've got two of them. Um, he's got the, uh, the deeper, fluffier one today. So uh, he is a very happy chappy, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> Put you back there. Um, so, yes, I've got my number seven advent calendar. So I'm going to open that today. Bentley's very interested <laughs> in that. So let's have a look and see what is inside day number 11. Now I still have, I need to take these upstairs, all of my other number seven um, bits because I thought oh, I was going to try them maybe like every day. But actually what I'm thinking of doing is waiting until I've got maybe like all of the skincare that's inside the advent box and then like using it all together just to kind of see how all of it works. Um, just because I thought then I kind of get the full effect as to um, if it's going to be any good for me. Because, yes, I'm very kind of like spotty and things um, at the moment. And um, I think it's just, you know, life, like work, stress and all that sort of stuff. It's just making my, my skin quite um, uh, spotty. So I am trying to find different sort of um, skincare things to kind of maybe help it out a little bit. I love the, the Tropic um, stuff and I've always had amazing results, but just for some reason it just isn't helping with um, the like hormonal sort of stress spots. <laughs> but anyway, um, so we are on day number 11. So number 11 is up here. Let's see what we've got. Oh, it's a big one. We have got... Oh, nice. We have got Protect and Perfect Intense Advanced Daily Hydration Hand and Nail Cream. Lovely. And that is a, um, a nice size, 75 mil on that one. I love a hand and nail cream. <laughs> so um, if you'd watched my Vlogmases maybe before, you, I have mentioned a few times that um, I am a bit of a nail biter. And I go through stages of biting my nails and then growing them and they're all beautiful and then I bite them again and then I grow them again they're all beautiful I'm kind of in the growing stage at the moment so usually when they're in when I leave them to grow they are quite long but I'm kind of in just the sort of middle stages of just getting sort of nice nails I always try and do nice nails over Christmas <laughs> where I can so that will be lovely that one I think I will actually try um, a little bit earlier. Let's try that one. Take the uh, tab off. Be a good idea. Oh, it smells nice. It's got a really, really nice smell. Nice and clean and fresh. Lovely. So there we go. That is... Um, Day number 11, really happy with that one. So yes, I'm going to head out, see my friends. Um, and then I, when I come home, I think I am going to see if I can do a little bit of sewing. I haven't done any sewing for ages. So um, yes, I will try and do that if I can. But I'll catch up with you a little bit later on.
again. So <laughs> I had a lovely time seeing my friends. We went to um, like a dessert sort of restaurant. Uh, it's called Creams, and yeah, they just literally do desserts like crepes, waffles, sundaes, hot chocolates, all that sort of stuff. And it was really, really nice uh, to catch up with those lovely ladies. And uh, yeah, we all had some like really nice puddings. We all had waffles, which I think I should have inserted some pictures um, there. So yeah, my friend Lauren had like a banoffee waffle. My friend Caitlin had like a chocolate cake sort of waffle. Um, Jenny had a lotus biscoff sort of one. And I had a Ferrero Rocher one. It's like, mmm, yum. And we all had a milkshake, I think. Three of us had a Snickers milkshake and I think Caitlin had a Nutella milkshake. So, oh, it was very, very good, but it was very sickly. <laughs> it was really nice. I think we all managed to just finish our like waffles. Um, I'll say just, yeah, I think uh, myself and Lauren, I think finished ours. But then I think, yeah, Jenny and Caitlin was a little bit, <laughs> had a little bit left over, um, but yeah lovely time and yeah we were just catching up and chat like chatting for absolutely ages probably well yeah like nearly about five hours I think we were in there for because it was it wasn't very busy um and so yeah we just um like sat there for ages just catching up and it's always just so nice to catch up with my friends and uh, just because we all kind of like live sort of quite far away now so we only really try and well we try and meet up at least once a month um, just to go out for lunch or something just because of you know where we all live and everything we used to all like live on each other's doorsteps and now yeah we've kind of like moved away a little bit so it's really nice to catch up with them um, and then suddenly I got a message from Stuart saying oh you better come home soon and um, the snow's really bad and I was like snow <laughs> I was up in Crawley which is um, probably about I don't know half an hour's drive from where I am and um, and yeah I was like What's snow? I was like, we haven't got any snow. And he was, sent me a picture and I was like, oh, goodness. So, um, yeah, set off back. And as I was driving down the motorway, it was absolutely just the snow was coming down. It was getting a little bit, you know, kind of funny where you couldn't really see like where the lanes were and everything. Everyone was going really slowly. Um, and then I pulled up to my house and um, we've just had um, like sort of like a new driveway done when we had our garden. And um, Stuart said, just be a bit careful because we obviously don't know what it's like in the in the snow um, and everything. And it kind of goes up at a sort of a slight angle. And um, when I parked my car, I put the handbrake on and it just wouldn't stay. It just kept slipping down. So, um, yeah, we kind of managed to sort of just park it slightly off, um, you know, kind of just because we're, we're quite lucky. We're in like a cul-de-sac. So me kind of coming off the drive a little bit didn't cause too much hassle. Um and so then we thought, OK, well, let's get some shovels and um, also go down to one of the local sort of like council, like salt boxes, um, which is about a 15 minute walk for us, which is actually quite an issue. It's granddad. So we popped over, just made sure his granddad was OK, made sure it's like his steps were um, were gritted and everything. And uh, yeah, then came back and tried to grip the driveway a little bit more. So we're going to park my car on it a little bit later <laughs> so um, yeah that was fun so we had a little wander in the snow um so yeah kind of felt quite Christmassy um and yeah just come back um Stuart's getting some dinner on we're gonna have steak for dinner tonight so I'm really really excited for that uh so yeah unfortunately not gonna have much time for sewing because um, it's already gone seven o'clock and yeah so we're gonna eat dinner um and then yeah just kind of like just chill out for a little bit so we want to spend a bit of time together because obviously i've been out with my friends um all day so i don't think i'm gonna get any sewing done today so it's another day of not doing any sewing um i'll do some cross stitch or something like that in front of the tv because then it's, it's still something that i'm doing but I'll try doing some sewing tomorrow Let's see how we get on <laughs> Okay, so let's do my Beyond the Pink Door Advent Box. It's like, oh, I can see gaps in it now. Uh, so we are on day number 11. So number 11. See, there we go. Number 11. See what we have today. Oops, let me 
got we have the packet we have got oh we have a dressmaking pencil can you see there oh i'm not sure if you can read that there well it's very sort of gold and shiny but it says dressmaking pencil and it is a chalk pen a uh, chalk pen chalk pencil <laughs> so that's lovely thank you very very much andrea so i'm going to leave it there for today and uh, yes, I will catch up with you on Vlogmas tomorrow. I'm working from home tomorrow because fingers crossed we have the broadband man in. Hopefully he'll turn up this time. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> okay, well, take care, everyone. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.